Hi, I'm Tom. These are my friends Jack and Cinco. Today we're going to imagine a reality where Walter White and Breaking Bad doesn't have cancer. Grab your coffee and sit back. In an alternate reality where Walter White never received that devastating diagnosis, his life took a different turn. He continued working as a dedicated and brilliant chemist, enjoying a stable and contented life with his loving wife Skyler and their son Flynn. Walter's career in the chemical industry flourished, and he made a name for himself through groundbreaking research and innovations. He was well respected among his peers, and his family lived comfortably in Albuquerque, New Mexico. Without the pressures of cancer and the looming sense of mortality, Walter remained a law-abiding citizen, content with his achievements in the scientific community. However, as the years went by, a spark of ambition began to stir within him. One day, an old friend and colleague, Elliot Schwartz, visited Albuquerque to propose a partnership. Elliot, now a wealthy entrepreneur, offered Walter an opportunity to co-found a revolutionary chemical research company. The proposal tempted Walter with the prospect of pushing scientific boundaries and gaining immense wealth. While tempted, Walter hesitated, torn between the desire for financial success and the fear of straying from his stable life. He confided in Skylar, seeking her advice. Skylar reminded him of the importance of family and warned against jeopardizing their tranquil existence. Feeling grateful for Skylar's grounding influence, Walter declined the offer, choosing to prioritize his family's happiness over potential wealth. He continued to work diligently as a respected chemist, finding joy in contributing to the scientific community. As Flynn grew older, Walter shared his passion for chemistry with his son, encouraging his curiosity and guiding him through scientific experiments. Their shared interest brought them closer together, forming a strong bond between father and son. Though Walter occasionally pondered the path not taken, he cherished the stability and love he found in his family life. He never lost sight of what truly mattered, and his contentment served as a reminder that sometimes the most fulfilling life isn't the one filled with extraordinary achievements or grandiose success, but one that is grounded in love, purpose, and meaningful connections.